Thanks mm -hmm. because of my toodles. Hey guys. I just uploaded my April empty video and now I'm going to do another video today. I'm going to do a full face. I'm going to talk about the makeup I'm going to put on my face. I'm going to do a full face. So let's get into this because I figured I needed something new. So I'm not going to promise you that I'll do this all the time. I'm doing nice. So I'm going to put on the Milani primer on my face. It's one of my favorite products of all times. And if I pause this and because the alarm goes off in the bedroom, because I have to get my husband up at, at I get him up at 901 to go to work, but today he's actually off. So we're gonna be running some errands today. Just a couple, not a lot. Unless he has something he needs to go do. But. Usually I do a different routine when I before I put on my makeup. I usually use my blemish pads. But. I'm not going to use those today. I want to do my face because. I want to. put on before I I usually my anti blemish and I put on my face toner and I let it set before I do my makeup and then I put on my face primer after I get my face primer on I do my brows and I'm using NYX brow pencil Am I me looking in the I know a lot of makeup's not cruelty free, but I also know a lot of makeup is going cruelty free, and that is so good. I have so much stuff to do today. It's like it's supposed to rain this morning, and I've got to wash clothes and hang them outside, and it's gonna rain. <laughs> Getting out what I need. Okay. My, this can see. After I do my brows, I come in and I do my can across my forehead, down my nose, I get these little crevices here, I go across my chin, I get right here where there's crinkles, like pit, some people call them pits. I hate to double dip, concealer has a lot concealer, that's just one reason why I like this concealer, so Revlon, Keep this concealer out because you make up we want concealers where you have to double dip. I hate double dipping concealers. That is one thing I do not like is to double dip a concealer. Once I have my concealer on, I start and I'm not no. I it's because I want to get it done, but I want to get it done. Yeah. I get it. And I'll blotch it. All right. My next step is foundation. And for foundation, I have. Number seven foundation and tart foundation. I'm gonna use the number seven foundation. I squirt a lot of foundation on a beauty blender or on your makeup brush. I use a beauty blender and I go like this on my face 
and put dot here, 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 and here. And then I come here and, and blend it in. You always want to blend it in your neck. Because if you just do your face and you don't have it blended in your neck, people are going to know you're not wearing, that you're wearing foundation. And don't mind that. I'm losing weight. That's why it's hanging. And then I go from one cheek uh, down to the next cheek, the forehead. And I try to get every and crevice of my face. I know a lot of people, they're they put all their foundation, things like that. Excuse me. I put liquid foundation. Very liquid foundation. Give me a second drink. Sorry about that, I was choking and I needed something to drink. Sometimes, I will either put a chapstick on my lip, or I've been using this lip oil, as you can tell. It is something I wanted to use more of, and I noticed that I have totally, totally been using my lip oil. So, I'm going to use a lip oil. Do the lip first. I'm gonna do it now. This coming out, you can tell I've been using this lip oil. And if y'all hear in the background, it's YouTube. I was listening to YouTube videos playing Happy Acres this morning, and I've left it so. My next step, I'm going to get my eyeliner. I always put my eye down like this to do it because I get the corner better. I get it really good in the corners of my eye like that. That's what I like about it. Night of last night, and I didn't finish it. So when the alarm goes off at nine, and since my husband's off today, I'm sorry, I'd go in there and and watch it. Got that. Next step is my eyeshadow. I'm gonna use my cosmetic palette. I will be switching this palette. That's what it's looking like. I've gotten some shades finished off in here. I, think I got one shade that I need to finish. But it's cool. Now. I wanted to use up palettes that have shades that have been panned, and I wanted to get the shades get it finished up. I know what you are thinking. The shade is too dark for me, and it's a dark, dark brown shade. Then I'm putting it on. I have. To make it look good. 
Don't worry, it's not gonna be this dark. Oh, I did the bad. It's like a dark, not wrong. Like a dark purple. Let me see something here. What's this black shade? Okay, yeah, I my eyes, but. But I'm looking in the thing on my eye. And if you can hear George Lopez in the background, <laughs> and just watching George Lopez. So I got all that done. Oh my god, I'm not even recording. What? What is recording? <laughs> Alright. Next is the blush. I mean, not blush, but highlighter. And I always do my highlighter on my, up here, my nose, here, and here. Sometimes I do it here. It actually depends on how I feel. And the last thing is my foundation. I, ooh, uh-oh. <laughs> I think I got a little bit too much in here. So I stick my brush in there. When I do, I tap it. I don't tap. Some people tap it, but I just sling it. It lands on the floor. It's clean. And you can do makeup all over my shirt. This is I told my kids they I want I want to tell my I could my makeup my bronzer contouring bronzer whatever. But be prettier. This way, I already panned it. This, this week and next week is the weeks that I'm really wanting to get into using products that have been panned. And so I want to work on getting the pan 
like bigger. Ouch. Getting the pants bigger or whatever's pant getting used up so I can have it. Some of the products gone. And then I can go through and say, okay, this product has been panned, it's done with, so I'm good. And I'll use another foundation. Another powder foundation with one of my favorite brushes. I got this brush off a of wish and I love so much. Or another one of these brushes. so I can get this brush I've had this brush for three years or better and it's still a good brush I actually bought this brush when I had my office was here used the brush until I moved into this room and I started using it because I needed another brush to use and I that crap to use So now that all the powders and makeup's on, I'm going to go through, put on my mascara. Very good mascara. I'm actually not wanting to do a mascara to clutter, but I have mascaras that I like. The mascara, my most favorite mascaras. A lot of drugstores, but I like one high end mascara that I have tried. So that's two page better than sex mascara. That is one of the high end mascaras. That's one of my faves. Now I have a whole bunch of sticks here that I. And I saw that I had a couple of wet and wild lips that I definitely need to get used. Because it's funny, they just could not be. This looks, uh, I will, sometimes I do wipe it down and clean it, but since I know I'm the only one, I will clean my lip glosses like that, the tubes off. I know last but least thing is my face primer. Not primer, yeah, my setting spray. This is a, a water, but I don't know how to use it after. And I looked up. So that is my full face for today. I hope you enjoyed it, this video, because I enjoyed making it. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell if you want to be notified of any more videos. And don't be shy. Head to your nearest drugstore or nearest store or even go on the website. Go try out the Elf Drops. It is so perfect. I like it. Mm -hmm. Till next time, guys. Bye. Don't forget, if you're new to my channel, welcome.